King eight clubs for Pierre makes it six hundred. But there's a point two five thing. Or no, it's, it's like spreads to be point two five. Four full? Six full? That's all right. It's weird. I remember seeing it somewhere when people were gambling outside. There is something about the World Cup where it's like everyone just Back puts like their country's flag on. Queen eight four. Top top for easy. Uh, Finally, no, really Finally really something to work with for him. Pair of eights. Pair of eights, yeah. We got to the semifinal. And easy goes for the check. Pierre takes the rope here. And are we going for a good old fashioned check raise? We are. 3,000 is the new wager. And somehow they decided to make the World Cup into par, where clearly the choice is Australia based on all the different bits. Pierre makes the call. In position on easy, but behind. Needs help, a king or an eight. That's not it. Another queen. For easy. Pierre blocking the set of eights. Another queen fall, so unlikely that easy has a queen. So perhaps Pierre thinks he's up against a heart draw. Maybe a set of fours. A couple combos of that. Is that winter then? I don't know if that's They're right in the middle, so it's just all the time. And now the price is 7,000, and Pierre, reaching for chips, not a non-believer, makes the call. So drawing dead, is hot Pierre. brewing, 21.5. Some money coming back to easy. So I don't remember how it works. Quadrophenia. Vote for Pierre. Got to finger he's maybe good here. Quadrophenia for easy. Maybe the worst card in the deck for Pierre. A disguised ace queen here. Nobody ever believes squads. Does Pierre he think he's up against something like nines or tens? Would nines or tens check raise the flop? Unlikely. Same with jacks. He's blocking pocket king, so does easy have aces here? It's a really strange board. And I don't know if Pierre's going to be able to get away here. He is squirming in his chair. The big winner from yesterday might be shipping over his entire stack to easy. Yeah, there, there's definitely stuff like that to qualify for the World Cup. Worst like, card, I think, on the river for Pierre was the Queen. All of Europe's in different pockets. And then, like, there'll be, like, a tier A team and a tier B team all the way down to, like, a tier that no one's heard of. Yeah. So, uh, the, the tier A's are usually almost guaranteed to qualify for the game. The playing is no one who's ever heard of. But Italy didn't qualify this year. I guess an 8 would also have been a pretty darn bad card. Heck, up here in the 9th seat today. We should have probably had him in the 8th seat. So they're actually better now than what they were when they were qualified. For the breeder's purposes? Anywho. Can Pierre get away here, folks? If you like the blender. You can find it here four times a week. Pierre won 70,000 last night. Easy come, easy go. Easy playing with quads. Euros to every two years. Two years Euros, two years. And then World Cup after two years, then Euros again. And the years in between the qualifying. Plenty of draws on the turn that have whiffed. But Easy's been stacked once bluffing. You got to think a man who's kind of taking a shot, playing a little bit higher stakes than he normally does. Will he lose his mind twice? Unlikely. Great fold. Half the table saying bluff, half the table saying quads. Shows the ace of diamonds. A great lay down there from Pierre. Gets away somehow. Some way. We've had a couple great laydowns. There's your cumulative winnings. I think JD's laydown was pretty good. 
Although you make a great point, there wasn't much in that pot to go after.